Good morning, gemstone lovers. This is David Artini with Artinian Gems, and I am in a hotel somewhere in Alabama. I'm getting ready to do a gem show with one of my favorite clients. And this morning, I was meditating on, um, you know, a lot of stores will ask me, well, I want to do better. We want to succeed at our gem party. And what is it going to take? Well, there are basically three things you have to have if you're really going to succeed. Number one, you have to have the tools. You need training and you need tenacity. Now, the first thing, the tools part is easy. We provide all that on our website. Um, and there's a countdown timeline. There are training video. There's all that kind of stuff on our website. And uh, we can go over that when you are ready uh, to do. And if, we, if you decide after this third thing we're going to talk about, if you decide this is still for you, we can look at it. So the tools, the training, we also have that on our website. Uh, you know how to train your staff if you're a good store, which I assume you are. Uh, you train your staff on a consistent basis. And as the owner, you train yourself. The third thing is tenacity. Now, that's the part I cannot help you with. So you either have the tenacity and or you don't. And if you don't have it, you're willing to go get it. So let's talk about that for a moment. Uh, what I find is there will be big stores, I mean multi-million dollar stores, that can hardly get the minimum. Why is that? And then I get little stores, an army of two, that have absolute you know, success. They're like doing $50,000 gem shows. Why is that? Well, I'll, I'll give you a hint. Number one, they know their outcome. They set a goal. They'll set a goal of a dollar volume goal. And number two, they set an outcome goal. And I'll give you a hint. A successful outcome goal is 50 people coming through your door. And what they're willing to do that some of the other stores are not willing to do is they're willing to persevere until they succeed. Every sports figure, every successful person sets an outcome and they are willing to do whatever it takes. They will demand more out of themselves than anybody could possibly ask of them until they get their goal. For example, I'll tell a store, okay, we've got to get 50 people through the door. And I'll, I'll arrive at the store and they'll say, well, we just, we couldn't get 50. We just couldn't get the commitment. I beg to differ with you. And where I beg to differ is I believe the lack of commitment is on the staff's part. They don't believe they can do it. But if you really believe you can do it and you're willing to be tenacious and you're willing to not stop until you get 50 solid commitments from your clients, I guarantee you, you will have a, a tremendously successful gem party. Because let me tell you something, success is not found by giving into our you know, tendency to want to relax. Success is always on the far side of pain. If you're willing to endure the pain, you will succeed. Every sports person knows that. Any, any concert pianist who's been successful knows that. Um, any successful business person, scientist, you pick a field. They're willing to endure pain in order to reach their outcome. So if you're willing to, to temporarily put aside your comfort, and if you're willing to commit to the process of getting 50 solid people through the door on the day of your show, this just might be for you because the gems are going to be beautiful. We have an entire training program on our website for you. I will stand shoulder to shoulder with your staff and help you sell. And if that's you and you're excited about the idea of selling more color this year, give me a call. Reach out to me somehow. I'll help you sell more. Thank you for your time and I hope to see you soon.